I gained a fair bit of audience feedback from my classmates and other associates during and after I finished editing the, uh, the music video. Uh, from this I've learned that we needed to be a bit more varied with our locations, so we had to take the camera back out and film in different locations to stop it from being too repetitive. And I also learned that if we were to do it again, uh, the writing on the plastic would have to be a lot smaller so that you couldn't see the edge of the glass in the shot because we didn't realise this until after editing and by that time there's not that much that we could do about it um, however it's a pretty easy fix if we were to do it again as we just have to make sure the button was smaller uh, another section of the video that we've been told we could improve is uh, the beginning when Brad moves towards the camera in stop motion as uh, in the first couple of shots, I think it is, uh, the camera's accidentally moved, so the scenery behind Brad is jolted a little slightly, which uh, once again is an easy fix if we were to do it again, because we just have to make sure that the camera stays still. Uh, however, the overall feedback was positive. Uh, people liked the idea of the writing on the plastic, uh, they just thought it was effective, but obviously they gave us the criticisms to make it slightly better if we did it again. Um, they also thought the stop motion aspect was um, effective with the, the nature of the song and it reflected the same sort of upbeat atmosphere that the song needed. 